What if the universe as we know it comes to an end? Imagine a reality where the stars no longer twinkle, galaxies cease to spin, and all matter dissolves into oblivion. Frightening, isn't it? But it's a possibility that scientists have been pondering over for centuries. They've formulated a myriad of theories, each more fascinating than the last, about the potential demise of our universe. From a big freeze to a big rip, the possibilities are as intriguing as they are terrifying. So, let's delve into these fascinating theories about the fate of our universe. Imagine a universe growing colder and darker over trillions of years. That's the big freeze. This chilling theory suggests that the universe will continue to expand indefinitely. Picture this, galaxies moving further and further apart, the space between them stretching out like an endless rubber band. As the universe expands, it also cools. Stars will eventually burn out, leaving behind only their cold, dark remnants. This isn't a fast process. We're talking trillions upon trillions of years. As the universe grows colder, it will also become darker. The light from stars will fade, and the universe will gradually transform into a vast, dark, and icy wasteland. But what about life? Could anything survive in this freezing, pitch-black universe? The Big Freeze theory suggests that life as we know it would become impossible. The universe would simply become too spread out and cold to sustain it. This theory is based on the concept of dark energy, a mysterious force that's causing the universe to expand at an accelerating rate. If this expansion continues unabated, then the Big Freeze is a very real possibility. But don't start bundling up just yet. The Big Freeze is just one of many theories about the fate of the universe. While it's a chilling prospect, many other theories propose different, equally fascinating ends. A chilly end indeed, but let's explore what other theories propose. Or, what if the universe collapses in on itself in a big crunch? This is where our exploration takes us next. Picture this. Instead of expanding indefinitely, the universe suddenly halts its outward journey, and like a cosmic yo-yo, it starts to retract. This is the essence of the Big Crunch Theory. The Big Crunch Theory predicts a future where the gravitational pull of all the matter in the universe will eventually overpower the current expansion. This would cause the universe to stop expanding and instead start collapsing back in on itself. It's a bit like rewinding the Big Bang, with the universe getting denser and hotter as it shrinks. Imagine galaxies spiraling back towards each other, stars and planets getting closer and closer until they're all crunched back into a singular, infinitely dense point. This could potentially lead to another Big Bang, birthing a new universe in a cycle of cosmic rebirth, but that's purely speculative. The Big Crunch is a dramatic notion, to say the least. It paints a picture of an intense cosmic implosion, a universe surrendering to gravity and collapsing inwards into a single point of unimaginable density. But fear not, this is but one theory among many. The universe has kept its secrets well hidden and its fate remains a tantalizing mystery. An intense end, but there are other theories that propose a different fate. The journey through the cosmos continues, so buckle up as we delve deeper into the enigmatic end of the universe. Consider a universe torn apart by its own expansion. Welcome to the Big Rip. The Big Rip theory is a fascinating, albeit somewhat terrifying, concept. It suggests that the universe in its infinite cosmic dance is not merely content with expanding, but is doing so at an ever-accelerating rate. Now, imagine the implications of this relentless expansion. As the universe continues to spread out, the gravity that binds galaxies together will eventually be overcome. These vast collections of stars, our cosmic neighborhoods, will be torn asunder, scattered into individual, lonely stars. But the universe, it seems, isn't satisfied with just that. The relentless expansion continues, overwhelming even the powerful nuclear forces that hold stars together. They, too, will be ripped apart, leaving behind only their constituent atoms. And still, the universe isn't done. In the final moments of the Big Rip, even these atoms, the fundamental building blocks of all matter, will be torn apart. The universe, as we know it, will cease to exist, replaced by an infinite expanse of nothingness. While this might sound like the plot of a science fiction horror movie, it's a genuine scientific theory. It's a stark reminder of the incredible forces at play in our universe and the dramatic potential of its ultimate fate. A dramatic end, but let's consider a more subtle endgame. Picture a universe where all energy becomes evenly distributed, leading to a state of no thermodynamic free energy, and hence no possibility for entropy to increase. Welcome to the concept of heat death. This perspective, 
fascinating in its own right, is a long-term view of the universe's future. It's the idea that over an unfathomable stretch of time, the universe will ultimately reach a state of maximum entropy. But what does that mean, really? Entropy, in simple terms, is a measure of disorder or randomness. The second law of thermodynamics tells us that in a closed system, like our universe, entropy will always increase. This is the natural progression of things, from order to disorder, from low entropy to high entropy. In the case of heat death, the universe becomes a kind of cosmic soup, where all matter and energy is spread out evenly. There is no more heat, no more cold, no more stars, no more galaxies. Everything is just a uniform temperature, a lukewarm bath of particles. In this state, no work can be done, no processes can occur, because everything is in equilibrium. There are no temperature differences to drive heat engines, no concentrations of matter to cause gravitational collapse. It's a universe at rest, a universe that has run down, exhausted its capacity for change. A quiet end, but there are other theories that paint a different picture. What if our universe is just one of many, and its end is just the beginning of another? This leads us into the captivating realm of the multiverse theory. It's one of those ideas that's as fascinating as it is mind-boggling. Imagine for a moment that our universe, with all its galaxies, stars, and planets, is just a tiny bubble floating in a vast cosmic ocean. This ocean is filled with countless other bubbles, each one a separate universe with its own laws of physics and its own history. This is the essence of the multiverse theory. But where does the end of the universe fit into this? Well, some scientists propose that when a universe reaches its end, it doesn't just disappear. Instead, it could collapse in on itself, creating a singularity, a point of infinite density. This singularity then explodes in a big bang, giving birth to a brand new universe. So in a way, the multiverse theory suggests that the end of our universe could be the start of a new one. It's a bit like a phoenix rising from the ashes, except on a cosmically grand scale. A universe dies, another is born, and the cycle continues, potentially forever. It's a compelling idea, isn't it? A never-ending cycle, but let's explore a more speculative theory. Imagine a universe where quantum fluctuations can create a new universe. Welcome to the mysterious world of quantum theory, where nothing is as it seems. In this realm, it's suggested that our universe's end could be triggered by something as subtle as quantum fluctuations. Yes, you heard right, quantum fluctuations. But what are these fluctuations? Well, in the quantum world, even empty space isn't truly empty. It's filled with what we call quantum fields, and these fields are always fluctuating. They're like ripples on the surface of a still pond, constantly shifting and changing. Now here's where things get really interesting. Some physicists suggest that if one of these quantum fluctuations were to become large enough, it could create a new universe. This isn't just any old fluctuation, but a shift so significant that it creates a bubble of space and time, separate from our own universe. This bubble universe would then expand at an astonishing rate, devouring everything in its path, including our universe. The birth of a new universe would mark the end of our own. It's a theory that seems more at home in a science fiction novel than a physics textbook, but it's a possibility that some scientists are taking seriously. A quantum leap indeed, but what if the universe simply fades away? Consider a universe where dark energy becomes dominant and tears everything apart. This is the essence of the phantom dark energy theory. In this scenario, dark energy, an elusive force that permeates our universe, becomes dominant over time. The phantom dark energy theory proposes that the density of dark energy could increase to a point where it overpowers the gravitational forces that hold the universe together. This dark energy would then cause the universe to expand at an ever-accelerating rate, eventually tearing apart galaxies, stars, planets, and even atoms themselves. To understand this theory, we must first grasp the concept of dark energy. It's a mysterious force that scientists believe is responsible for the accelerating expansion of the universe. It's called dark because it doesn't interact with light or any other part of the electromagnetic spectrum, making it invisible and extremely difficult to detect. Now, imagine this dark energy becoming so dominant that it starts to rip the universe apart at every scale. First, it would tear galaxies apart from each other. Then, the dark energy would become so strong that it would start to dismantle stars, planets, and even atoms from the inside out. This is the phantom dark energy theory, a cataclysmic end where the universe tears itself apart due to an overpowering dark energy. A dark end, a 
there are other theories that propose a more peaceful end. What if our universe is just one phase in an infinite cycle of expansion and contraction? This is the intriguing proposition put forth by the Big Bounce Theory. This theory posits that our universe could be just one phase in an eternal sequence of cosmic events. Imagine a universe that expands, like ours is doing right now, but eventually reaches a point where it can expand no more. At this moment, gravity takes over and the universe begins to contract. It contracts until it's once again a singularity, a point of infinite density. But then, instead of this being the end, it's actually a new beginning. The singularity explodes in a new Big Bang, and a new universe is born. This is the bounce in the Big Bounce theory. The idea is that this cycle of expansion and contraction, birth and rebirth, could be happening forever. It's a theory that challenges our perception of time and space, suggesting that there's no beginning or end, just an infinite cycle. The Big Bounce theory is still very much theoretical and not without its challenges. It requires a new understanding of the laws of physics and the concept of singularity. But it's a fascinating idea that expands our thinking about the universe and its possible fates. An eternal cycle, but let's consider one final theory. Imagine a universe where a bubble of lower energy vacuum could expand at the speed of light and destroy everything. Welcome to the concept of a false vacuum, another intriguing theory about the ultimate fate of our universe. In the realm of quantum field theory, the vacuum we perceive is not necessarily the lowest and most stable state of energy. Instead, it might be a metastable state, also known as a false vacuum. This theory suggests that our universe could be in such a state right now, teetering on the edge of stability. So what might happen if we fall off that edge? Well, a bubble of lower energy vacuum could form. This bubble wouldn't be filled with nothingness, as the term vacuum might suggest. Instead, it would be a region governed by different laws of physics, laws that may not support the existence of atoms, stars, galaxies, or life as we know it. And here's the kicker. Once formed, this bubble would expand at the speed of light. Because of its rapid expansion, we wouldn't see it coming. One moment, everything would be as it is now. The next moment, everything would cease to exist. A chilling thought, isn't it? But remember, this is just a theory. Scientists are still exploring and testing these ideas, trying to understand the true nature of our universe. A sudden end, but whatever the fate of our universe, it's a fascinating topic to ponder. So there we have it, 10 theories about the fate of the universe. We've journeyed through a range of possibilities, from the chilling big freeze, where the universe expands into an eternal icy wasteland, to the cataclysmic big crunch, where everything collapses back into a singularity. We've pondered the Big Rip's extreme expansion, tearing apart galaxies, stars, and eventually, atoms. We've considered the heat deaths concept, where the universe slowly runs out of usable energy. We've explored the multiverse, quantum theory, phantom dark energy, the big bounce, and the false vacuum. Each theory presents a unique vision of the universe's ultimate destiny. But it's important to remember that these are all theories based on our current understanding of the cosmos. The true fate of the universe remains a profound mystery, a riddle that science continues to unravel bit by bit. Remember, the universe is a mysterious place, and its end is just as mysterious as its beginning. Before we wrap up, we'd love to hear from you. If you've learned something new from this cosmic journey, why not give this video a like? It's a small action that goes a long way in supporting the channel, and we're curious. What are your thoughts on these theories? Do you have a favorite or perhaps a different theory altogether? Share your opinions in the comments below. We learn as much from you as you do from us. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to stay updated with more mind-bending content. And if you think your friends or family would enjoy this cosmic journey too, don't hesitate to share it with them. After all, the mysteries of the universe are best explored together. So until next time, keep wondering, keep exploring, and keep unraveling the mysteries of the universe.